holy shit. That was unexpected and awesome. Jimmy Kimmel got an exclusive from the Captain America Civil War trailer and it is great. We've been waiting a long time for this trailer and I think it was worth the wait. It definitely delivered and this film has moved up on my most anticipated movies of 2016 list. The trailer opens with the post credit scene that we saw in Ant-Man but dwells deeper into it by showing Bucky remembering who Steve is. This scene also tells us that the government want him dead for his actions when he was brainwashed as he assassinated a bucket load of people and this is when it all kicks off as Steve is going to stop them from getting to Bucky. Thunderbolt Ross has returned and it's about damn time. We last saw him in The Incredible Hulk which just seems so long ago and he's the one that must bring up the registration act as he tells Cap, people see you as a hero but there are some that prefer the word vigilante. That they have been working with unlimited power, no supervision and the world can no longer tolerate this. So people have had enough of the damage that occurs when the Avengers are around, such as the people of Sokovia that had Ultron try and drop their country from the sky and the rage outbreak that Hulk had in Africa. I am eagerly hoping that the Hulk incident is a big reason Thunderbolt came back so they can lead on to Red Hulk. Come on Marvel, I would love to see Red Hulk at some point. And speaking of Sokovia, there's this file in the Sokovia Accords that he hands to Scarlet Witch I think. So I am thinking this is the version of the Superhero Registration Act that we'll see in this movie and the Sokovia incident was the last straw. We cut to Black Widow telling Steve to stay out of this one as he will only make it worse. Widow was on the government's side in this movie and her telling him to stay out of it just shows she cares about him and doesn't want him to escalate it or get hurt. They got really close in The Winter Soldier and their dynamic that felt brother sister like at times is going to be under pressure in this with him challenging her claim with are you saying you'll arrest me? It will be interesting to see how they handle potentially facing off with each other, potentially as she might be a double agent. This next part weirded me out a little as we see Tony Stark talk about limitations and controls and agreeing with the government which is strange as we're so used to him being a smart ass and cocky and being like I'll do what I want, I'm Iron Man motherfucker. But it made more sense over time as creating Ultron who could have destroyed a human race must have showed him that without controls on heroes something that friend Lightning could happen again. The hero we've all been waiting for has finally arrived in all his glory as we get our first look at Black Panther and oh damn he looks so good. His suit is perfect and the tribal like marks on his helmet around the neck and gloves make him stand out from the crowd and I'm starting to wonder how he fits into this. The rumour that Winter Soldier killed his father when he was brainwashed would be a good way to do that so I hope they use something similar to this. I can't wait to see him in action, he's drop kicking Bucky he can outrun Cap, he's just going to be so awesome and I cannot wait to see him. This shot definitely raises the stakes of this movie, War Machine is unconscious, badly injured and you can see his arc reactor has been ripped out. Bucky most likely takes him out as the shot before shows him attempting to take out Iron Man's arc reactor. I'm thinking this may push Tony over the edge in this movie and make him go that's it, no more playing around, this is finishing and the fighting between the teams will just get much worse. So when the feels train made a stop in this trailer inside the last few scenes with Cap telling Tony that he wouldn't be doing this if he had any other choice, he's my friend and the reply just made my heart sink. Tony's face just drops and with the saddest of tones says So was I. I'm in a glass case of emotion! The trailer ends with Cap and Bucky tag teaming and beating the piss out of Iron Man. I am beyond excited for this movie, I watched the trailer about 10 times, it was awesome. Anthony and Joe Russo did a great job with the Winter Soldier, I trust them with this and if they pull this off it will be amazing. Well, that's it for me guys, if you liked the video, rock it on the like button, leave a comment and tell me your thoughts on this trailer, also don't forget to subscribe as it really helps me out. This has been Vanquish X, thanks for watching and stay tuned for the next video.